So let's open the console of this lab. First of all, start the lab and open the console. Now here it's getting signed in automatically. Basically here we have to enable the API. So go to the API and services and then library. Now here go to task number one, copy the API name carefully and just paste over here. Now click on it and just click on enable. So once the API is enabled, open this conversational agents and the GitHub repo I've shared in the description of this video. Just open it and make sure to open an incognito window. Now basically what we need to do the first thing select the project if you are unable to find the project just click on all and select the project id make sure you have first signed into the console so now here a pop-up will come wait a minute now we have to enter the app name so for the app name go to the lab instructions and just copy the name carefully create agent build your on your own just select the region from the lab instruction and then create flow just follow the way i'm doing you have to select flow now click on create now here what we need to do we have to change some settings so for the settings do this three dots and settings now here scroll down and enable these two logging and conversation history and save it now we have to restore the agent so for the re agent i've shared the github repo what you need to do just click on it and just download it to your local system click on it it will download to your now local system from here you have to click on upload and just upload the file which you have downloaded just here just click on restore and it will restore automatically now basically we have to create two versions and two environments so let's start click on this version just follow the way i'm doing now click on default flow now click on create for the version go to the github repo and here copy the name carefully just paste over it and save now for the similarly for second one just follow the way now once you have saved now go to the environments and we have to create two environments qa and dev so copy the name here now you may face one permissive error just select the version one make sure you are selecting version one so again copy to dev now if you get this error no need to worry just try again and it's safe now create again dev for this we have to select version two make sure to select the version two only now we have to test the agent so just test for tests message just copy the message here and just hit enter now what you need to do you have to just restore it so if you are unable to see other actions so i mean the environments just refresh the browser and select the dev now again you have to just paste the same message and you will get the output now for restoring just you have to click the that arrow circle arrow that we have to select now if you are unable to get the score no need to worry just wait for some time and again go back here and just restore it and try again so just wait and you will definitely get the score so finally we got the score.